Did you get off to a decent start in the 400? Do you have like an internal clock to say I need to be at a certain place at a certain time? A bit. I, I've been working on uh, getting out of the box and really like sprinting the first 20 or first bit of the 400 and then I just coast away. Let's talk about the 100 today. How about that? Oh, that was a, that was a good race. It's a really good competition and um, I think the weather was nice. My legs were warm. It went well. And that's the race where you really need a good start. Yeah, definitely. And I've been working on this year. My coach, Coach Kelting, is very good about starts. So. Uh, when the competition is better in your, in your heat, do you think you run better? Uh, that's where I'm a little off. I feel like I can focus better when I don't have competition, but the competition does push a little bit more. So it really just depends. Tell, tell us about uh, when you went to that meet in Colorado, how well, well you did, or maybe did you surprise yourself down there? I surprised myself. Like, um, we had some great competition. The number one girl or in the one, two, and four was there, and I ended up winning in the four, so I did surprise myself a little bit, but I was really glad that we got a chance to race there. Are you going to be racing the, the 800 this year? I think so, yeah. I've been working on mid-distance, and... If um, I can uh, coast the same kind of pace that I do in the 400, then I know I can PR and do really well. So it's kind of weird to run the sprints and the distances. I mean, do you, do you prefer any any either of those? It is really it is kind of a weird combination, but um, sprints sprints are nice. It feels fast, but so I see the sprints. Was it weird uh, changing schools and then sitting out for a little bit with other sports and just kind of waiting until your turn? It it was weird. Um, I didn't get to see a lot of faces that I was familiar with, so that was difficult. But I I mean I'm just lucky to be here and have the chance to run today. So. And what are your goals for this year? Uh, for outdoor. Just keep PRing, keep doing the growing the season. That's really all I could wish for. So.